The brothers asked me earlier with regards, which is an important question. Alhamdulillah, we find, you know, some of the, the shabab, the youth, they attend seminars, alhamdulillah, and the conferences, but the lessons, we don't find the same level of participation. Again, I advise the brothers and the sisters to learn on a consistent basis, not just conferences, not just seminars, not just YouTube videos. Take time to learn. Take time to learn, alhamdulillah, learn Arabic for yourself. Learn, alhamdulillah, the basics for yourself. When you learn, you will find a sweetness in knowledge. And when, alhamdulillah, you find that sweetness, it's like Sheikh Mukbil used to say, rahimahullah, he said, when we open up Bukhari, all of the problems of the world disappear before our eyes. Talab al-ilm la ya'adiluhu shay. For the one who has a pure intention, they will find seeking knowledge is one of the greatest delights. When you're reading a book, it's like you can't stop because that's how much you enjoy it. And anyone can relate to that. Anyone who sought knowledge, na'am. If your intention was correct, you will have, you will taste that sweetness. And the best days of your life will be the life, will be the time, the days when you sought knowledge and you tried to remove ignorance from yourself. So I advise, yes, the brothers and the sisters, try and attend a lesson even if you work, even if it's one lesson a week, even if it's two lessons, based upon your schedule. Alhamdulillah, innama al-ilmu bit-ta'allum. And look, the sign that Allah wants good for a person. Man yurid Allahu bi khayra, yufaqihu fi deen. Whoever Allah wants good for, He gives them understanding of the religion. But understanding of the religion, you have to learn.